I wanted to preface this video by saying that I blurred the other user's name out because this all just seems like a bit of fun and all the more reason to go after these bots. That being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and take it for what it is. I had a lot of fun with this and this definitely made things more interesting. Remember my bot busting videos? Yeah, those videos. While those videos picked up some traction and it seems like a lot of you guys had decided to make accounts for this, which is great. There's been a good influx of people taking out these bots and improving the health of the game. However, I was surprised when I woke up today to some new Discord messages from an account I didn't recognize. I was extremely confused by this, so I did some digging. Now it all made sense. But why? How could such a small YouTuber make such an impact? I was shocked to find out that whoever was running these bot farms was this upset to contact me. But then I got thinking about it. I quickly checked my loot tab and was surprised to see almost 30 mil profit in just a day and a half. This really opened up my perspective to just how much money I was making off of these bots and taking away from the bot owners. Pair this with the other people who said that they've been making these accounts, and I could see an insurmountable dent being made in this bot farm. So just how much are these bots making? Well, I took the average, about 400k, per loot key, and times that by the amount of member worlds as there are bots on every single member world in this spot typically. So 161 times 400,000 totals a whopping 64,400,000 coins per cycle just from the single Rev Cave spot that we've been hunting via the Rev Cave Telly. Now what do I mean by per cycle? Well the 64 million coin figure basically factors in an average of every bot completing their cycle through their tasks to their GP threshold limit. So it's believed that these bots have a limit of GP that they garner before they decide to leave. Now we pick 400k in this video, but this isn't an exact number, this can vary slightly, and all bots don't get done with their cycle at the same time, however this is the best way we have to get a generic understanding of just the sheer amount of GP moving through these accounts. So to further grasp how much GP these bots are making, we need to figure out how many cycles per day they're completing. Assuming the average cycle is about 20 minutes, we can divide the amount of minutes in a day by 20 and we come to the result of 72 cycles per day. Now, as mentioned, this is not exact, and I think it would be safe to put a range on this anywhere from 50 to 80-ish cycles per day per bot. So let's take an average of 60 cycles per day and multiply that by our GP threshold average of 400K. Now this leads us to the result of 24 million GP generated per bot per day per full cycle run. To put this into perspective, we can multiply this 24 million GP average times the number of membership worlds, 161, and we come to a whopping 3.9 billion GP per day, or about 1.2 thousand USD per day. So, we can safely assume that this one bot farm in this one particular place in the Rev Caves generates roughly a whopping 365,000 US dollars per year. Factoring this in, if the bot owner has any other spots or any other bots, this could easily gross a 1 million per year bot farm operation. You might be asking yourself, what was my response to this? The war.
had been started.